Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is my second video. Today we'll be talking about uh, close range shooting drills that I use a lot with, my, with the kids in, in the academy for use for the 11s and 13s and 16s that I'm sure that you can adapt to your reality. So any given age group, you can, I'm sure you can use this drill. I really like this one because it really forces the players to think before shooting, before taking the, the, the chance. The situation that they are facing the goalkeeper, I always try to, to emphasize that it's not just hitting the ball with Tony and then going for the, the ball going inside. So I really force them to think before taking the shot, to, to try to see the angles that the goalkeeper might open. So this drill is, is really good for them. I hope you like, I hope you can adapt to your reality and stay with me until the end. Right, for this activity, I divided them into two groups, the green team and the black team. So now the black team is going towards the main goal and the green team is going towards the small goal placed on the side. So the teams will be facing each other and what we want to emphasize is for the players to leave immediately after the whistle so they can be in a good position to, to be facing the, the goalkeeper right away without having to, to beat the defender. I let them play for five minutes and then I change the lines, switch them up so they can be facing another situation, another goal post, size, another goalkeeper, so it can give them another experience doing the, the, the exercise. We as coaches, we need to be instructing them for when the situation comes, when they are facing the goalkeeper, when they already beat the defender and then face the goalkeeper. They need to be thinking before taking that, that chance, that shot, so by placing the ball on the sides, not just hitting the ball strongly. So many times during the match, during the trains, they, they do that. They hit the ball strongly and the ball goes out or the ball hits the goalkeeper. So they end up losing the, the chance to score, the opportunity to score. Right now I separate the young group and the older group. So now the blue ones are facing the blue ones because of the age. They chose to do like this because it's more competitive. They are playing against kids from the group age. So you can also adapt like this. So the same goes for the black team. These are the oldest guys. So in order to be more competitive and more intense, I put all of them together. Because in this specific day, I had a mix of under 12s and under 14s. important for us coaches, I would make sure that the, there is intensity and the activity is competitive so we can simulate the situation of the match. So I hope you guys could understand what this drill about and I also hope that you can really put this in practice in your next training sessions. And let me know in the comments below what you think about the activity, what would you change, how can we make it better, so I'm, I'll be happy to hear from you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also follow me on Instagram, yurifoster.92, so we can be in touch here and there. See you on the next videos. Merry Christmas. Peace.